In January 1980, I was at a friend's house celebrating a birthday. During the party, the telephone started ringing strangely. Silence. And all the blokes began putting drinks and food down while patting their pockets for car keys. The man of the house loudly declared to one and all, We've got one. Got one what? As they all ran out the door, I was left to wonder what the hell was going on. I spoke to some of the people still sitting about and asked about what had just happened. The guys that had rushed off were from the Rosebud Fire Brigade and had gone off to fight a fire. Wow. When they got back, I asked them about what they did. About an hour later, I knew why, how, where, who and when they did what they did. I was also invited to come down to the station the following Sunday morning and have a look. 33 years later, I don't get to the station on a Sunday as much as I'd like to. I'm busy doing lots of other CFA stuff. Over the years, I've given a lot of my life to CFA. At the same time, I've received a lot. What has being a volunteer firefighter done for me? It gave me lasting friendships. I had the wonderful opportunity to meet my new wife, the love of my life. It led me into a very exciting and satisfying career as an emergency services manager. It provided me with experiences both horrific and magnificent. It has taken me to the other side of the world. It's allowed me to lead teams to communities all over Australia and help them respond to and recover from devastating experiences. I've met many great people, some well known, others not. All have done wonderful things for their communities and I'm humbled in their presence. I've been lucky enough to experience CFA in many different roles over the years, from new recruit all the way to Level 3 Incident Controller. I'm now employed by the organisation that I've committed more than half of my life to. Over the years I've given a lot of my life to CFA, at the same time I've received a lot. I reckon more than a fair trade.